Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to day 19 of 22 days of lipstick and for today's video I'm going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Zana Beauty's The Nanga collection. Now I have with me four shades as always. Check out the description box below to see the shade names and for foundation shade reference I'm NC40 in MAC. Now before we can get into the lip swatches, the formula, the pros and cons, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to notify whenever I upload and now let's jump in the video. So these are priced at 799 rupees so 5 ml of product and they offer 7 shades. So this is how the packaging looks like which comes in this clear tube with a black cap and at the bottom you have the shade name and number and this is how the applicator looks like. And now let's finally move on to the lip swatches. Alright, so let's talk about the formula of these liquid lipsticks. Now these are pretty thin in consistency, like it's pretty liquidy. At the same time, it is extremely pigmented as well. Like with just one dip, I'm able to cover my full lips and I'm good to go. Now these are quick drying and once it is dried down, it settles into a nice comfortable matte finish. Now these are quite comfortable and lightweight on the lips that so it does not feel like you're wearing any lipstick or anything on your lips at all. Now these are transfer proof for example, there is almost zero transfer and these are obviously mask friendly and they last for like solid 7 to 8 hours if you do not eat anything and once you do have a heavy meal this is how it looks like. And for the removal of these liquid lipsticks, you do have to use an oil based remover. For me, I used an oil infused micellar water and it worked like a charm. So I do love the shades, especially the four shades that I picked out for myself. They are perfect for my medium skin tone. And also when things are back to normal or whenever I am going to go to office, I do see myself actually reaching out and using them like an everyday nude lipsticks. Oh, I almost forgot to mention, I love the shade names, especially Chaddi Buddy and Nanga Punga. I just had like two FIIs just to let you guys know. Firstly is the pricing of 7.99 rupees and that may seem a little bit high. However, having said that they have like great offers running on their website. So for example, right now at the moment while I'm filming, they do have like a 50% off site-wide with all the whole collection. And I'm not so sure that offer is still going to be valid when you're watching it or whenever I'm uploading this video. But they do have offers running around the clock. They have something or the other that's always going on. And even mine that I picked out, I got like for buy two get two free kind of like an offer the second thing is that the shade nanga punga as well as brown and lovely they do seem a little bit similar on my skin tone like with just a little bit of a variation on their undertones so if you are planning to choose choose either one choose wisely or if you really want to buy both then great and now coming to the cons the first one is the availability now these are obviously available on their website however I'm talking about websites and apps like Nika or Purple or uh, Amazon and Flipkart 
these are not available there now i used to be like this in even to this date some of my friends are but they're kind of skeptical about buying things off of the brand's website directly and they kind of prefer going through you know like a big e-commerce website like nika or amazon but at the same time i feel that a lot of people are missing out because it is such a good formula the shades are beautiful so yeah that is the first con for me the availability the second con is to do with the shades now these shades are beautiful but i'm talking about a different collection where there could be like red shades or pink shades bolder colors it would be amazing so overall i do highly recommend these liquid lipsticks because the cons are not like a big deal breaker or anything and if you are planning to buy i would highly suggest to wait for some kind of a sale where you can pick it up for a lower price or if there's any offer going on which is usually throughout the year but wait for a good offer or a sale and then pick them up and uh, yeah these were my thoughts on the zani beauty's nanga collection and guys this wraps up today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so you're notified whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests i will try my best for you as well as follow me on my socials which is instagram on instagram and instagram on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye